Hi there, welcome to Get to Plugins tutorial series. Today I'm going to show you how you can add product variations in WooCommerce with label and button swatches from scratch. In the last two videos I explained how you can enable label swatches from globally and manually created product attribute variations. For your convenience, I have added those videos link in the description below. I'm assuming you have already installed our popular WooCommerce variation swatches plugin on your site. As I'm going to explain how you can enable product attribute variations with label swatches from scratch, I'm going to show the time-saving way. Product attributes can be created globally and manually. For a manual process, you have to create the same attribute and its variation for each product every time. On the other hand, when you create a global attribute, you can assign it to any number of variable product without repeating yourself. So I'm going to present this tutorial creating a global attribute. To create a global attribute, head to the site backend and navigate to attributes from product settings. For demonstration purpose, I'm going to create label attribute called pattern. Choose button type from the type drop down and select add attribute button. You can notice pattern attribute has been created successfully. Now select configure term to create it variations. We will create three variation for pattern attribute. They are red, green and blue. Let's fill variation name field with red and press add new pattern button. To add green variation, fill name field with green and press add new pattern button. Lastly, do the same for blue variation, add blue name in the name field and click add new pattern button. After creating global attribute and its variation, you can assign them to any number of variable product easily. For demonstration purpose, I have chosen a product. Make sure the product you would select, it has variable product selected from the product data drop down. Select attribute tab, click on the custom product attribute. In the custom product attribute drop down, you will find all your globally created attributes. You can notice our globally created pattern attribute is there. Select pattern attribute and click on the add button. After that, press select all button. You can notice it will bring all your assigned variation inside your selected attribute. You can notice on my end, red, green and blue variation come up. Check use for variation settings and press save settings button. Now get into product variation tab, click on add variation drop down. It brings another setting called create variation from all attributes. Add variation setting will add each variation one by one. Create variation from all attributes will add entire variation at once. For this demo, I am going with the second option. From here you can insert all variation related data you need. I am going to insert only variation price and image. Let's select red variation first. Add price and choose your desired variation photo from the media library. You can upload a new photo from your computer as well. Now select green variation, add price and select a photo for it. Do the same for the last blue variation, add price and select a beautiful picture for it. After inserting variation prices and images, select save settings button. Now head to the product frontend. On my end, everything is working as expected. Hopefully you have found this video helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and stay connected.